uh, good morning. This is Stinky Sock Secret Stash here with a couple of pickups. It's been a minute since I picked up anything. This is on the Secret Stash channel. Um, I just want to go through these. I just got maybe about, I think, about five or six games for some various different systems. Uh, the first game I picked up is uh, for the Nintendo 64. It is Kobe Bryant in NBA Courtside on the Nintendo 64. I don't know if I have this game already. I have not checked in my... I know I don't have that many Nintendo 64 games. I know I have Kobe Bryant. Um, I think, what, Courtside on the GameCube. But, yeah, it's nice to add this to the collection. If I have it again, I might have to give it away. But, um, definitely nice. Feels nice to have another Nintendo 64 game. I like how they feel in my hands. Feels great. Up next, we got a PSP game. Very cheap PSP game. I think it cost me maybe two bucks. And that is, um, Mercury. I know I have, like, a, I think, Mercury uh, Revolution on, uh, I think it's the Nintendo Wii. Um, have never really played the Mercury games. I heard that they're cool, they're fun. I'm always, like, I like puzzle kind of you know, different kind of games that are kind of just kind of weird to play. But definitely, Mercury, I'm going to have to give this a try. Up next, we can complete a, a series that I have. And I already have the first game in the series for the, for the SN, for the, not the SNES, for the uh, Nintendo Entertainment System, the NES. And that is... Rad Racer 2. I have one up in um up on the shelves somewhere. But now I have Rad Racer 2 to the collection and I, I feel complete because it's completed now. Now I I, I I feel like my life is whole. I, I feel great inside because I got Rad Racer 2, you know. I don't think I've ever played Rad Racer 2. I've played a lot of Rad Racer 1 as a kid and even as an adult. So Definitely gonna have to play some Rad Racer 2. I hope it plays pretty much the same. I hope it's even a better game than what Rad Racer 1 is. Now that I got Rad Racer 2. Yes, Rad Racer 2. Up next, we have a Super Nintendo game. Um, continuing to collect for the Super Nintendo. It's very expensive, so I'm trying to just... We're just going down the list of the most inexpensive games first and then kind of working my way up as I can. Um... If things get too expensive, it's all it can always you know emulators and stuff. And I got like little handhelds where I got this what Abernack that you know RG three fifty where I can you know I got emulators on here. So if it's something's too expensive, I can play that you know hopefully trying to find something that can hook up for the TV you know a little connector or something for the TV that I can sit there and capture that later on sometime down the road. But the game is NBA Showdown. Yes, just before everything turned to live, you know, that in-between part before, you know, where it was like Bulls versus Lakers or, 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 or Lakers versus Celtics or Pistons versus, well, I don't think it's Pistons versus Trailblazers. They should have Pistons versus Trailblazers, you know, be being a Pistons, Pistons fan and all. But that, that in-between part just before, it, we, you know, NBA Live took off and it, it you know, it'd be, you know, and it became what it was. We still had NBA Showdown where, okay, the aesthetics look like NBA Live, but it's just, it's still slowed down like how um, the, you know, NBA versus, ser you know, series was. So, you know, nice to have this in the collection. Um, might play as the Pistons. Might not play as the Pistons. I usually, I try not to be a homer, like in a sense, I try not to play as the home team's. And like a season, I try to play like another team or a team I'm not familiar with. Or sometimes it's just nice to go back and you'd be like, oh yeah, I remember that player. Or I remember that player from the 90s. So it's cool to have this in the collection. Can't wait to play it though. Um, I have played it already though. I said I've played it before. I think I've rented it as a kid. Um, next up is a... Let's see. We have another game I think I'm trying to complete. I think it's one more on the system that I don't have, and that 
It is, this is for the PlayStation 2. This is Hitman Contracts. I think Blood Money is the one I don't have. I have the other one, but I don't have, you know, this is nice to have on a collection. I used to sneak play this, like my brother owned this game, but you know, maybe, you know, I said, you know, some years ago, and when he was off at work, I would sit there and play Hitman, or I'd play his other PlayStation 2 games, because like the games I had was more like sports, but you know, sometimes you want to play other things other than sports, so I'd play like Hitman or like Scarface. I really like that game. I said I might have to pick that up at some point, but Scarface was a really good game. But definitely love playing the Hitman series. Want to get back into playing it. Um, definitely capture some footage with it. Um, and have some fun with it. You know, definitely it's always fun to pick up something. It, you know that you can pick up some good games that are cheap. You know, granted, I know we always want like the new stuff. And but the new stuff, it, it look you paying if it's a Switch game, you paying like sixty dollars, and the price really goes down unless it's like some like, you know, some third you know, third party title that you know is on every platform. But or you're paying like seventy if you got like you know a new you know next gen system. So it's always nice to get something you know you can play you know maybe get some nine or ten hours into it. Definitely a good one to have. And last up is I'm um, still I'm surprised I don't even have this game. This is for the uh, original PlayStation. Um, I'm surprised I don't have this game. I have a couple of the games in the series, so I'm trying to complete this series of games, and that is the game day the game day series. And so I got game day ninety seven. I'm surprised I don't have this in the collection. I'm I'm really surprised that I don't I didn't have this in the collection when I looked. Um, got this really cheap. Um, got the little the game in it and stuff like that. It looks really nice and stuff like that. I can't wait to play it. What what does it say? It says most advanced gameplay ever. Players think, react, and perform like they do in the NFL. Artificial intelligence has teams learning your playing tendencies. If you don't mix it up, your game plan teams will learn to shut you down. They're going to learn to shut down my attack. Look, I spent what? I spam the run, run button all the time. I, I don't think that's going to, you know, I want to test that theory out. We're going to have to test that theory out. Look. I'm going to play, you know, just run all the time because that's pretty much what I do in football games. I, I usually run. It depends on the game. But I usually like to run because I try to play safe and stuff like that. So if they're, they're going to shut down my running game and they're going to force me to pass? I don't think so. I, I, I'm up to the challenge game day. Yeah, I'm up to the challenge, okay? You're talking about one of the best football playing video game people on the Internet self-proclaimed wise okay you know other people might not say that and they might not think that but i'm gonna sit there and put my name in the hat that yeah i'm holding it down and so if this artificial intelligence that you have think that you can sit there and shut me down go ahead and try it i'd like to see you do it that that being the case it's nice having this in the collection um definitely i can't wait to play this just to, to, to test that theory that might be a very good video to try is to see you know just to play it on normal to see if that's what the the artificial intelligence does is that they actually do shut me down um got some really nice features more features than current day madden well, I mean, of course you always gotta say like this has more features than current day Madden, and that might not really be true. Talking about a game from 1997, you know, total pass control allowed you to lead and throw under and underthrow receivers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm I'm up to that challenge. But you know what though, I can't really sit there and say that th this is this is better than you know that this is better than Mad Madden current day when it doesn't have the Washington Commanders. Okay. Hell, it doesn't even have the Washington football team. <laughs> that being said, nice to have Game Day 97 in the collection. And that is the end of these video game pickups. And just in general for right now, um, looking at some other games, I'm hoping to get a little bit more cash um, from work, you know, working the holiday and retail. So we'll see what I can pick up. And until next time, thank you for watching this pickup video here on this 
Stinky Socks Secret Stash channel. Until next time, peace, peace, peace.